I need to know are we lie. If we are lie. Hey everybody. Uh, I apologize. Uh, they had some boxing equipment. They had some boxing equipment at the uh, Clinic. And I got in trouble for uh, we're working out. Lady came out. Man. That's for my boxing class. Why are you? But, man. I still got it. I still got it, ladies and gentlemen. I still got it. Let me tell you. I still got it. I still got the power. Can I tell you? I got the power. Can I tell y'all? I got the power. Um, like I told you, every time I leave, the devil and his demons always got something for me. I came back. Crow screen was on the damn floor. It's two zappers right beneath the screen. And luckily, luckily, the screen did not catch on fire. Luckily, the screen did not catch on fire. But it's right there in the chair. I'm going to uh, put it up in a little bit. It's right there in the chair. You can see I was able to save a lot of the tape. I was able to save a lot of the tape that I had holding it up. So we're going to uh, try to put it up and iron it. And then uh, hopefully that'll work. But as y'all can see, this is Kitty Bird Bullshit Paint. I cut it in two to give y'all a better example. Like I said, uh, Monday, according to the tracking, I should be getting um, two more samples of Kenny Bank from um, from Silent. Crow 1176 provided these two. So now they in the center of the screen. And this is the reason why Kenneth Bird is not doing demonstrations. Why he playing around with cardboard boxes and trying to make a computer. Because we have exposed his scam. We have exposed Kenny Bird's scam. He's been exposed, ladies and gentlemen. We have exposed the bird man. The bird man paint is trash. Look at that. Why would you buy this shit? I ain't your cousin. I ask you a question. Why would you buy this shit? Can I ask you a third time? Why would you buy this shit? Why would you buy it? Why would you buy this dog bullshit? Matter of fact, I'm gonna give you another example. Hold on. I should have. I, I should have thought of this before I started. I apologize, y'all. I should have thought of this before I started. Hold on a second. <clears throat> is it still there or did I move it? Did it, did it that fell oh, down. Yeah. It's still here. No, it's not there. Where's that fabric on there?
Okay, I'm almost ready, y'all. Hold on. We're gonna have for y'all.
still not perfect. We gotta do better than that. We gotta do better than this. Alright, give me a piece of tape. Break this in half. I am really sore from yesterday. I mean, I, <laughs> that punching bag put some on. I ain't gonna try in front. That punching bag, it put some on. As a man, I'm telling you. Uh, if you ain't worked out in a while, your body lets you know what the hell were you thinking? What were you doing? I'm sore as hell, but I feel good. That's the one thing about exercise. But yeah, I slept hard. I was supposed to throw the screen up last night. My body was like, ah, you ain't doing that tonight. Like he said, I can tell you a lot of things. One thing I can tell you. You ain't doing that tonight. You going to sleep. My body went to sleep. And I woke up. And I was going to do it again. Look at this shit just falling down. You doing your best, ain't you? Somebody don't want, the, somebody don't want this to go up. Somebody coming in their drawers. Somebody's coming in their drawers. Somebody don't want this to go up. And the question is why? Why don't you want it to go up? Why are you mad? Why you don't want this to go up? What are you scared of? If Ken's paint blessed by God's technology, then what's the problem? You should want this demonstration to get done. You used to be angling for it. You should be saying, yeah. Put this stuff to the test. Because it's powered by God, right? Isn't it powered by God's technology? Isn't this powered by God's technology? Isn't that what Kenneth Bird say? This pain is powered by God's technology. So what's the problem then? If it's powered by God's technology. Shouldn't be an issue, should it? All right, we got, yeah, now that side came down. <laughs> you know you're wrong for this. You know you're wrong. And we're gonna turn this fan off. Turn that fan off. All right, ladies and gentlemen, here we come. Are y'all ready? Are y'all ready? Since Kenneth Bird ain't doing no demonstrations today, I got some demonstrations for you. Take a look up on the wall. We have a gray on the wall. In the middle, two panels of Kenneth Bird's paint. And on the right, we have a black fabric. What's the difference between that black piece of fabric and Kenny paint? What's the difference? I'm asking you, what's the difference? And remember, Kenny's paint is in the center. So we have gray. We have two of Kenny's FLE in the middle. And we got a black fabric on the right. Do y'all see a difference? Answer the question. Do y'all see a difference? What's the difference? I'm asking you, do you see a difference? And we put Kenny Bird stuff in the middle. So it's getting it's getting the best of the it's getting best of the bug. Y'all see a difference? 
So let's go take a look. Wait a minute. I, I, gotta, I ain't got to do this, but I got to do this. It's, it's bugging me. Even though it ain't got nothing to do with the demonstration, I got to turn that desk around. It's, it's blocking part of the screen. Come on. You know you're wrong for that. Get out of the way. All right. I'm back. Sorry about that, y'all. Right, let me get something to drink while I'm up. Ready? This will be a minute. So I need somebody to explain me. <clears throat> so we got, we got every color represented. We got white represented. We got gray represented. We got two panels of Kenny LFE black. And we got a bed sheet. The best sheet is the farthest away from the center of the lamp. Can it hang with Kenny Bird paint? So let's look at some of the things that Kenny Byrne like to look at. Kenny Bird. Now I'm zoomed in. I can zoom in some more. But I want it to be fair. So before we do anything, let's see if Kenny Bird made him, came alive yet. Because we're going to make him do a demonstration. If you notice, he's messing around with that cardboard. I told y'all he ain't got no money. He, he waiting until Monday or Wednesday. And he's going to lie and say that he went out. He put orders out. He ain't got no money. First, my name's Kenneth at that same park. Technology screens and our FLED company, which will be coming out soon. Yeah, we're still working on all of that. Probably got some updates on that too, and some of the screens we're working on. But just to let you know that to my customers, thank you so much. We appreciate your business. I don't know how good this video is. What customers? Be, again, I am kind of Bluetoothing, tethering off my other phone, so yeah. There's what customers? The video is okay. It's not choppy. You can understand what I'm saying. But all the packages are out. All customers are taken care of. We had some orders that came in for some customers. Thank you so much. I appreciate the support. And we had some ship backs, which we had customers uh, ship back the items to us. We test them on camera to make sure they're working perfectly fine. And so he had some ship back. That was last week. You just shipping stuff from the people who you say complaining about your paint? You just shipping something back now? That was a week ago. You just shipping stuff back now. You won't believe that. Ain't showed no bottles. Ain't showed no paint. He ain't painted nothing. He ain't showing you anything. But he sent some ship backs. The customer complaint that he showed you, both of them were perfect bottles. Remember now, he only showed two bottles this month. We've seen two bottles. That Ken showed. And he used both of them in a demonstration. For customer putbacks. Both bottles were perfect. When he opened them. Not to mention. They were perfectly wrapped. Like somebody who done it before. A customer is going to have it all slovenly. They, cause they send that shit back. They don't care. They just gonna wrap it in, and, and put it in and send it. They're not gonna have it all perfect. So we know you lying. We know that Kenneth Bird is lying. He doesn't have any sales. He's not making any money. He waiting for you with the first or the third of the month. He can get some government money, and then he gonna go buy some paint. And then suddenly you gonna see paint. So the company is not helping him. He gotta wait for the government check. He has to wait for the government check. But he just told you. I'm doing shipbacks. Why are you doing shipbacks? If you're paying so good, and we're looking at it and we know it ain't. But if you're paying so good, why are you doing shipbacks? He's trying to work with the business. And listen. When we show that the product is working perfectly fine, we could send it back exactly the way it is. But I gave him a full container 
They gave us half, we gave them full, so we gave them a little bit more. And for those who felt that the screen was, um, they're not ready for the dark technology, we shipped out that new uh, platinum black silver. So I'm like, Now he just told you, the customers say, they not ready for that black technology. We're looking at the FLE. It did center in your screen. Somebody get this, they're gonna say what? This shit too damn dark, I can't see nothing. They're gonna say, I can't see nothing. They're gonna say, I can't see nothing. This is why you should not buy anything from Black Series Edition LLC. Do not buy anything from Crystal Meth Technology. Look at the bullshit. Look at it, it's right there in your face. Dead center, those two panels is Kenny FLE. That's a ten dollar bed sheet. I, I just cut a snippet. Put Poor, poorly cut, but I cut it real fast on demand, and you can see that it matches. So I showed you a curtain. <clears throat> I showed you a six dollar curtain that matches Kenny paint, and now I'm showing you a ten dollar bed sheet that matches Kenny paint. Matches it. Do you see a difference? Do you see a difference? Look at it. And I'm not rigging anything up. I'm not setting nothing up. I don't sell nothing. I ain't got nothing to gain. I'm just trying to save you customers are taking care from making a mistake. I almost made How we do our return policies for our customers. You'll never get stuck with one of those policies that are going to sit there and say, hey, because it landed on your front door, you're stuck with it. Or if you open it up, you're stuck with Man, it. Man, he been saying that since I came around. He's talking about crow policy. He's talking about crow's policy. I got news for you. I have crow's paint here, and it does look pretty good. I'm having a problem keeping the screen because he painted it, and it, it, it made the screen a shell. And it's hard to get it to lay down on the wall. And we're going to uh, work on that today. But we're doing this demonstration right now. But why he keep talking about what another man doing? The fact of the matter is, you just said, if it's too dark for you, that means the people are saying the same thing that I'm saying. It's too dark. They don't want you to send them another dark paint. They want their money back. But you won't give it. Because you ain't got it. So you're going to stall, scrounge up some old paint, send it to them. They're going to complain about that too. And eventually you hope when you have to send the money back, you can send it out your government check or you're hoping you can trick somebody into buying some paint so that you can cover it. But they paid three times what you paid. You only paid, if, if they bought a 24 ounce, and you bought a gallon for thirty dollars, and you selling that twenty-four ounce for one sixty-two. You can send them another twenty-four ounces. What what would that cost be to you? Ten dollars? Fifteen dollars? Seriously. So let's say, let's say that they return a twenty-four ounce. So you made one. 24 and 24 is 48. That's 48 ounces, right? He only paid $30 for the paint. That thing coming off already. He only paid $30 for the paint. He paid $30 for the paint, ladies and gentlemen. $30. He paid $30 for the paint. Both bottles still come out that, that one gallon. So what? He still made $130. Why is he crying? If he sold him a gallon and he sent him a gallon back, he charged $368 for a gallon. He only paying $25, $30 for the paint. So that means it would cost him $60. But he getting $368. Why is he crying like a little bitch? He still make money. He could send them back six gallons. Of what he charged them for and still have a hundred and something dollars profit. Why is he crying? Because the dope man got that money. That's why it is. He ain't got the profit. The dope man got it. 
That's why he cried like a bitch. The profit that he would get if he only paying $30 for the gallon and he charging you three sixty eight dollars with tax, it's what, three eighty. dollars 30 minus 380 is what? So even if he had to send you another gallon, that's only 60 bucks. That's 60 bucks out of 380. That leaves him with 320 hours. Why is he crying? He's he making money. If he can send you a lighter version and you accept it, instead of him getting a profit of 380, he get a profit of three fifty. What's the problem? I'm listening. Anybody want to talk to me? I'm listening. Why does that hurt him? Why is he crying about it? Even if you send him the paint back, he ain't paid nothing but thirty dollars for the paint. Why is he crying? Let's say that crow had a, a customer return. And he sent them another batch. If, if Crow paid $30 for the gallon of paint, and he charged him $60, if he got to send another one back, he ain't made no profit. 30 and 30 or 60. 30 and 30 or 60. Crow loses money. But Kenny makes money. Kenny makes $320 off of every gallon that he sells. If he had to, if he had to do a customer charge back, he would still get three hundred and twenty dollars. That would be a good scam if he wasn't a junkie. Because if 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 I send you the darkest, you don't like it, I send you something lighter, and you say, okay, I, I can deal with this. He spent sixty bucks, but he getting back three hundred and eighty. Why is he on here crying? He crying because. He got to pay the dope man. That's why. That's why he crying. Because it, it, it doesn't hurt him. A customer chargeback should not hurt Kenneth Bird with the prices he charged. With the prices that Kenneth Bird charged, a customer ship back should not hurt him. At the prices that he charged, he should have five or six bottles laying around on deck ready to go. Also for display. He ain't showing us a bottle all week. He ain't showed a bottle of paint since he did a chargeback. This is what I'm telling you. The man ain't got no money. The man can't do nothing. But we'll wait till the first or the third. I guarantee you. You'll see paint. He'll be talking shit. Watch. I've exposed the routine. I got him scared to do a demonstration. His demonstration look like shit. I got Kenny on the ropes. And it ain't just me. It's a lot of people. I'm just the most aggressive. I come at you real, raw, and tell you the truth. I don't make little jokes and make little, you know, gifts and little shorts. We looking at Kenny's, Kenny's video right now. This is Kenny's video. He's live in the park. Trying to lie and say that he, ship, he ain't doing nothing. He ain't got no money. That's why he in there playing with them cardboard boxes. It don't cost anything. He taking them from the UPS. They don't cost anything. Pretty soon they're going to start asking him, hey, you keep taking all these boxes. Or why are you not sending nothing? What are you doing with the boxes? Somebody going to ask him that sooner or later. One thing about a scam, scam has its time and then it goes. But even though he's showing a portrait, which ain't the whole screen, look at the bed sheet. Look at the bed sheet. And look at Kitty's two panels. Do you see a difference? I'm asking you. And the taping came up on on that corner right there. I don't feel like I. It's all right. I don't have to get up and move it. But anyway, take a look. Well, listen to him. Now we work with our customers. They ship it back to us. We'll test it out. 
If it works well and all goes well, I knew it. Still hook you up with no problem. I knew it. All right. Well, with that being said, look at that spring is out already. Look at the beautiful flowers. We still got to get up. Then yeah, the, the, the grain came down now. Sucks. Hold on. Summertime to get here. Hold on, y'all. Stuck on it. Get to come out and get some food and relax. Man, I think I'm about to town. I am so sore from that workout. God darn it. Walk through. I don't know how good the video is going to be. It hurts to walk. I've never had a chance to walk through here because this is always filled with people. Beautiful out here. Oh, I can't turn over there. Oh, shoot, the museum's open. Mother George. I'm going to the museum. And I'll do it tomorrow. You'll do it tomorrow. How pretty it is out here. It's beautiful. You always put something up. Do it today. You ain't got to worry about it. Do it today. Come on. Why you got to do it tomorrow? The spring's already here. I'm waiting for that warm weather to kick in. Give me a piece of tape. I'm wearing a hoodie right now. It's supposed to be going on, on, on crow's screen. I'm wearing a t-shirt. But anyway, we got all customers are taken care of. So we got our ship backs taken care of. Come on. We got our customers Dad. all taken care of. As I said before, we ship anywhere in the world. Someone's walking up this way, so we can't record this way. We ship anywhere in the world for free. And like I said, if you have a problem with the product, you ship it back to us. And we'll test it. Keep in mind, we do these sh ship backs. This is not to embarrass any customer in any way. No one knows who the customer is. We always keep that quiet. Stop lying. So all packages up, always only between us and them. We send you over video. How do we know? It's working perfectly fine. Is. And then, you know, if you feel that you want something a little bit that. lighter, we do make a screen paint called the Black Silver. Uh, it's a platinum black silver. It does work on the IWA projector, Valva projector, and so forth. You know, the projector you know, support, we do support on that product. It's a little bit right. lighter. And you're going to get a fantastic. Sorry, buddy, huh? So, you know, we make it dark, yeah. we make gunmetal, and we make a lighter version of it. That's black gorilla tape. That way, you know. You can see, it. look at all the tape on the wall over there. So once we get the acoustic screens up and going, then, you know, for right. those of you who really don't want to paint the screen at the end of the day, you don't have to worry about that either, because that's already taken care of. All right, well, I'm going to go grab some chips. My favorite things are funky. You ham? Funky is a bag of funkins. And I hope you enjoyed the video. If it's choppy, I do apologize. Did you hear him? He gonna go grab a bag of chips. It's his, it's his favorite. It's his favorite. And he gonna lie and say Funyun. That wasn't no Funyun. We saw what you had on that. That was a bag of cheap chips from a dollar store. You lying bitch. Why don't you stop lying? What you gotta lie for? Why you gotta lie, Kenneth Bird? Well, let's do some testing, y'all, because let's see if he came live yet. Did we scam him into going live? Let's do a refresh. Did we scare him into going live? Nope. It's 10.30 in the morning. You always talking about crowing and being, being lazy or whatever. Why you ain't up at work, sir? So let's, uh, let's take a look here. Let's do a, let's do a black screen test. This is an all black screen. Now you can see the gray is really standing out, ain't it? But if you notice, there ain't no difference between that black bed sheet and Kenny's paint. You can see that that the white white can't do black, even though it's two thin layers of black behind that white. White can't do black. You see that, right? So there ain't no difference between the sheet and Kenny paint. I got news for you. Ain't no difference between Kenny Paint and the, and the Gorilla Tape. Look at the pieces. There it go. As I talk about it, back of the screen. Ah, you, fuck, you, I ain't gonna say nothing. I ain't gonna say nothing. You know you wrong for that. You, damn, the whole thing fell. <laughs> the whole thing fell. <laughs> you know you wrong for that. You know you wrong. You know you wrong. We exposing this scammer. The devil don't like it. You expose the people. You don't like it. So you're going to keep knocking down the screen. So Gorilla Tape won't hold it up. That what you're saying? Not even Gorilla Tape strong enough to hold this up? Not even Gorilla Tape can hold this up? Gorilla Tape, ladies and gentlemen. We ain't using no cheap cheap. We ain't using dollar store tape. We are using Gorilla Tape. And it's still falling. We're using Gorilla Tape and it's still falling. 
I say it again. We're using Gorilla Tape. It's still falling. She said, I'm falling. All right. Anything else about the fall? What about you? How you making it? Everything good? Why well, come back over here? Everything good? Why well, am I? Is everything good? Is everything good while I'm up? Anything about the fall? All right. All right, y'all, I'm back. <laughs> there you go. Everything falling. Now, pillow just fell off the bed. Then knocked everything over. You know you're wrong for this. I ain't gonna say nothing. All right, let's get back to work. All right, let's get back to this. Y'all ready? So let's let, let's take a look at the fishy wishies. Are y'all ready? What's the difference between the sheet and Kenny paint? What's the difference, ladies and gentlemen? What's the difference? What's the difference? It's going in. Do y'all see a difference? I'm asking a question. Do you see a difference? I'm amazed at how many fabrics I've picked up over the year. Over the year, that I can keep coming to you every day with something different. It's amazing. Why well, can't oh, <laughs> Kenny showing you USPS boxes? He probably be the one making all the money. He got stuff from the dollar store. He's showing you samples from Screen Innovations, another company that sent him samples for free. He didn't pay for them samples. I paid for everything on the screen, except for the uh, the two panels in the middle that our Crow 76, Crow 76 donated them panels. So, so we can show Kenny Payne head to head. I need the fish to go through all three. Come on, fish. Come up some. So we can see it head to head. What's the difference? What's the difference, ladies and gentlemen? What's the difference? And we got Kenny Paint in the middle. Somebody tell me what the difference is. Where's the enlighteners at? Where are the enlighteners? Where are the enlighteners? Where's it at, Kenny? Going through the gray. Now it's going through Kenny. Let's see if it can, it can maintain that white. Can it maintain the white? I left space so you can see the white in between everything. There's space so you can see white in comparison. Look at the difference. See how the white on, on the fins, when, when, when they own the white, they bright white. When they go into black, they get diminished. It's still there, but it get diminished. Do you want to diminish? Look how it diminishes 
Just that part went through it. It, it, it don't diminish on the gray. The gray giving you a bit more contrast, but you can see the gray can't do black. All right, coming back through. Look at the gills. Look at it when they come out. Ah, you're gonna do me like that. Look at look at the difference. Look, look at Kenny two panels and then, then look at the black look at the black bed sheet. You see a difference. Do you see a difference, ladies and gentlemen? Let me, let me pause that. Do you see a difference? I see that piece of tape fell off, dog on it. But do you see a difference? Why would you give that man all that money? You can do the same thing with a ten dollar bed sheet. I'm asking the question. Why would you give that man all that money? You can do the same thing with a ten dollar bed sheet. What's the difference? What is the difference? So Kenneth Bird been doing this for 13 years. His, his 13 years of work is matched by a bed sheet. His 13 years of work is matched. His expertise is matched by a $10 bed sheet. Why not just sell a bed sheet? Why not just charge 80 bucks for it? Charge 80 bucks for it. Put some cardboard behind it, roll it up. Or get a film, roll it up. And send that. All right, going back in. Come back over to Kenny. So, all right, we've done a black test. L let's do a white test. Will it allow us to do it? No, we got to back out, unfortunately. Let's back out again. Back out again. All right, try it now. Okay, let's, let's get rid of that and try it. White screen, here we go. The dreaded white screen. You already see. We ain't got to click it. You already see. You already see. Let's go. All right. That's an all white screen. This is all white, ladies and gentlemen. Way the enlighteners. Where is the enlighteners? I don't see white on none of them. Does anybody see any white? Say, you white up my life. You make me want to carry on. You light up my day. Where's the white? Where's the white at, ladies and gentlemen? Where's the white? Let's go back in. We gotta get rid of that. Exit. Thank you. Where y'all wanna go now? Let's check out the Skyward food demonstrations at the bottom. I like that one. Y'all ready?
Now, we are in cinema. I'll take it to dynamic. Will that help without any? We in dynamic. Does the dynamic help without any? They go on the dynamic help without any? Y'all tell me. Now, can a bird told Salvo to crank up the settings? So let's let's go to the brightest mode on the projector. We're gonna to go to presentation mode. Now we were making fun of Kenny by doing the green. But we're gonna go reset. Reset, factory settings. And we're gonna help Kenny out. We're gonna put brightness on 69 and we'll put the contrast on 69. And we'll take the color saturation up to 69. So we're doing all 69. We don't get a bird like the BBC. So we'll put it on 69. He didn't want to show that demonstration no more. He don't show that part. He don't show this part. So we got gray to your far left. Kenny two panels of FLE in the middle. And we got a black bed sheet. Now let's go back to cinema. Actually, let's just go to uh, dynamic. Kenny Bird is a scammer. He's a scammer. Now we halfway across the room. We are halfway across the room. Yes, we are. Halfway across the room. So where you at, Kenny Winnie? Come in here and defend your paint. Where, where are your people at? Where are the Kinder Bird supporters? 
and support this bullshit. You can't even see nothing. Look at that dark shit. I guarantee you, if I switch Kinderbird two panels with that black panel, and I put that, I'm sorry, and I put that black top sheet in the middle, I guarantee you, it will blow Kenny out of the water. We got it off to the side. But somebody tell me, is that much difference? We got Kenny right in dead center. So he getting, he's getting the, the best the projector can give it. See, we fair. But y'all, we got we got four different colors on the board right now. Four different colors of display. We got white, we got gray, two panels of Kenny FLE, and we got a black top sheet. Do you see a difference between the top sheet, a ten dollar bed sheet, and Kenny Paint? Now I showed you a six dollar curtain. Day before yesterday, I showed you a six dollar curtain beating Kenny. Now I'm showing you just, just a, a, a sheet that I cut up. I cut that piece off of a sheet that was in my closet and threw it on the wall. Would you give Kenny Burns $400 for a gallon of this bullshit? Would you give Kenny $40 for a gallon of this bullshit? Y'all want me to zoom in some? Would that help it out? If I zoom in? Did that help it? No. And we got Kenny panels dead center. They are dead center. If y'all notice, if y'all notice, Crow didn't paint this part right here. Y'all see that? Crow didn't paint this part right here. And look at how it blends in with the screen. You can see words right there. It's words right there. Whatever piece of cardboard you use, it's words right there. They're like a zero or like a one. But look at where Crow didn't paint at. Look at how it blend in with the screen. So this must have been white. Or off white. Look how it blends in with the screen. Look at how that blends in. Right there where the mouse is. Look right there at the bottom of the, of the first panel. See how Crow didn't, didn't paint it all the way over? You can look up here and see he didn't paint the edge up here. Look how it sticks out. Look at that, ladies and gentlemen. When you get to season nine, you can tell. Look at how that blends in. Look at how it blends in, ladies and gentlemen. To show you how dark Kenny paint is.
take a look at something else. Did they got another skywork? Oh, the, the, the Winter Village. Remember, I'm zoomed in. Now y'all know about Kenny used such a small screen. You know why he had the projector so close and why he sit with the phone so close. This is showing you the same thing that everybody else that showed Kenny Payne it's showing you the exact same thing. The exact same thing. How can somebody deny it? How can you deny it? I don't sell anything. I don't promote anything. Up. Oh, the black pan agree come down. I don't sell anything. I don't promote anything. Yep. The black panel, you ready come down? I don't sell anything. I don't promote anything. I don't get nothing out of doing this. I want Kenny to go to drug rehab. And stop selling this shit. To the unsuspecting public. That's my goal. Call me names, I don't care. Make fun of where I live at, I don't care. You can make all the excuses you want to make. The same way people make excuses for Trump. Oh, Trump's a great president. He's a great guy, he is. Yeah, and they'll, they'll, they'll defend them to the end. Vincent Mann is a great guy. Defend them to the end. You better leave P. Diddy alone while they're raiding his house. He's a great man. Okay. Believe what you want to believe. They're just getting on him. They're just racist. Okay. R. Oh, Kelly don't mess with them girls. Why they messing with R. Oh, Kelly? Ah. Okay. Don't talk about DMX. Don't call him a junkie. He, he's a good. He's a great rapper. Okay. Like I gotta tell you, the gray be better than the black. You can't get a gray screen because you cannot read a hundred percent contrast and well, if I couldn't have the white, I'd take the gray. Mm, you're not being fair. <laughs> so, where's the white and whitener at? Look, look at this center panel right here. We're going r r right over some snow. Where's the white? Where's the white? We got them whiteners. Really?
Why would you pay this man four hundred dollars for a gallon of this bullshit? And I'm asking you, why would you do it? We got him too scared to do a demonstration. He gone live yet? Has the coward gone live yet? Has the coward gone live yet? Has the coward gone live yet? Nope. Why won't you come live, Kenny? Why are you sitting here doing this bullshit? Look at him. And we're gonna put in uh, black lighting and all that, so it's gonna be pretty cool. With a lot of colors and stuff. He's ever trying to put some cheap lighting yeah, around the, something. Um, liquid cooling system to look like a power station. So we're gonna have a lot of these wires coming off of it, like the yellow wire like that, maybe that right there, to come off of it and it's gonna be attached to each fan. It's gonna power the fans, just give it the illusion that it's powering the fans. Listen to like they're fighting on a power station. I want some. That's what he talking about, y'all. He ain't even talking about his paint. We scared him off his paint. Look at this. USPS boxes. He's doing a, a portrait setup. Look at that portrait. Look at him. USPS boxes. Cardboard box projection screen. This is called God is good. Let's listen to him lie. First one, Look, he back on the RCA monitor. LLC Crystal Edge Technology Screens and our FLEVT. Anytime I come on here and I talk about um how we may be going through something at the end of the day, uh, the naysayers come up and start rooting and carrying on saying, oh, he must be being punished. Uh, he's shenanigans and, and scamming is caught up with him. It's this, it's that, it's that, it's this. Let me explain something to you. And again, I can't express this enough that, you know, the reason why I put my faith in God is because God has always had my back from day one. Even when I was denying him and I was out there in the streets carrying on and acting up, he had my back because he had a purpose for me. Even when I went through the situation where I got myself in some really bad trouble, I was looking at They messing with my scam. Ah. Ah. UPS box. UPS box. I'm gonna take a look at this. This is at random. Me on here. Address, if any sign off and all this stuff. And they wouldn't make a mistake like Mister. Forget to put the period there. They got somebody who proofreads all this stuff. They make sure they don't come off looking like they don't know what they're talking about. They deal with other companies all day long. And other companies notice that in the day they might not do business with them. Over a little typo can cost you a contract. So yeah, they proofread through all their stuff. They would have never sent me anything like that. I know what those letters look like because I got sent those letters a few times because them. I beat someone's body and they didn't like it too well. But if you have to think that those kind of shenanigans and tactics, that shows me at the end of the day you're afraid of my stuff. Who afraid of this shit? Puts a smile on my face. It really does. Oh, I'm loving this man. I am loving it. This is actually, like I said, the darkest gun we've done so far. And you can sit there, and the funny thing about it is, you'll sit there and try to convince people not to touch our stuff at the end of the day. My stuff got contracts on it now. Contract. Kenny, I, do y'all see the green tent right there? That's just green tent right there. That's green tent. That is green tent right there. He's showing you something colorful. That's hiding, it's hiding the tent. But you still see it. But look, you see the tent right there. Look at the tent on his screen. 
Look at the green tent right there. You see it. Look at that green tent. We looking at the same paint right here. Look how dark it is. We looking at the same paint. This is Kenneth Bird's paint. We looking at it right here. Look how dark it is. Look. It's his paint. It's a match. Why it ain't matching? Why it ain't matching, ladies and gentlemen? It should blend right in. It's not. It's still darker. The tricks he's using to make this look light is what's causing this green tint. It, that's why he's getting chargebacks from the few people dumb enough to buy from him. And pardon me, I said dumb enough, and, and they, if you bought from him, and we telling you, and showing you proof and you still buy from him. Well, maybe you didn't see the video. I'll give you the benefit of the doubt. But if you buy from this man. This is the video I was looking for the other day. To work for you. You don't need all that. End up spending probably about under like $200 for a projector. That's it. That's all he spent. As a matter of fact, we backed it up 100%. That's the window display you see at the smoke lounge. Are those things you're pushing through that glass? Those are two 720p projectors, not back to back as one 720p projector, but they're going to spend about $3,000 for each projector. And I was like, dude, what you doing? I'm not spending that kind of money at the end of the day. Under $400. Then and that's what it costs. Why, why didn't you go to the uh, demonstration and go on site like you said you was last week? So he came in and he had the guy. You ain't had no money, bitch. And he went and bought them because he got two of them. That's it. So think how much money these seats. But if you have to spend a lot of money for your projector in order to show your demonstrations off, then you haven't saved any money at all. Okay. Let's add up we got on these two projectors. How much money all this costs? I will set up here. So all the demonstrations you see in the slideshows, all those videos, we didn't bring anything for those projectors. Those giant 250 inch screens outside, that projector was done on a... Uh, He's telling you something from years ago. We in 2024. That's it. So I'm talking about something from years ago. Years ago. Years ago. Years ago. Take a look at this video at random. At random. Look at the lime green. You can't even match our demonstrations. No, we don't do no 4,000, no, no 3,000. Let me see if I can zoom in. Try laser on it. We don't do any stuff. Really? Right, that doesn't help. About 800. I can't wait to get her case. She got a case coming in for her. I can move, I can move the camera over. Let her help. She's not even infinity black. And look at them shades of gray that pop up. We could do this in a full lit environment. As for your gray screens, well, we could blend into your white levels. And not only that, but these colors, as I said before, that you didn't even think even exist. And when it comes to contrast levels, you don't belong in our world. Look, look, look how green our hand is. Absolutely amazing. The event. This is absolutely amazing. Look at that green tint. That's absolutely amazing. Amazing to who, sir? Who's that amazing to? Who is that amazing to? Look at that green tent. Who is that amazing to? Who is that amazing to, Kenny? Who is that amazing to? But I do you one better. It's not showing up. Let me see if I type the. Will it show up? And then. Is it showing up? You spelled it wrong, dummy.
Delfinen. Come on, Sony. Wake up. <coughs> Open your eyes. This is Sony 4K. Beyond four times the resolution of 1920 by 1080, it will take you to another world. Oh, the grave fell on again. It is Great. a world seemingly familiar, yet filled with fresh revelations. Screw it. A young planet called Earth. Look at the cat looking, because it fell on top of her bowls. <laughs> you looking. So do y'all see a difference? That's a bright, colorful display. Y'all see a difference? Do you see a difference? Why would you buy this whole shit? I'm asking you. Why would you buy this? Why would you get this man between $172 and $382? Why would you get this man money? Why would you get that man money? Since it's a great fella, let's zoom in. We zoomed in. You see a difference? Ladies and gentlemen, do you see a difference? We zoomed all the way in. If you think you've seen it all, prepare to be amazed. We whooping Kenny's ass right now. He getting his ass whooped. This is Sony 4K. This is a new dawn. This is called eye candy. Sony 4K eye candy. Hey. Y'all ready? Y'all see a difference? Do you see a four hundred dollar difference? That's the question. Do you see a four hundred dollar difference? The two panels on the left are Kenner Birds F L E T F L E, and we zoomed all the way in. It's hurting the white screen we so zoomed in so much. Let's make it more fair. Do you see a difference? <clears throat> no need to buy his bullshit paint. Ain't no need. Now if you do, it's up to you. Huh? 
When a king pain fell out. Everything gonna fall. Is everything gonna fall, y'all? Well, that's how they gonna hit the head. <clears throat> Kenny's paint in the middle. It's amazing. <clears throat> there ain't no difference. Do you see a difference? Do you see a difference? No, you don't. Kenny Paint bullshit. Now watch. As soon as I go off the air, Kenny gonna come back. Watch. Then the hour. I guarantee you, Kenny will come live. Let's go check. Put the other panel for now. Has he come live yet? Does he have an answer? Does Kenneth Bird have an answer? Or is he hiding out right now? He said, oh, no, what am I going to do? Oh, that damn minister, he ain't he, he blown me out. Nope, still ain't came live. Ain't been live in 14 hours. Ain't been live in 14 hours. Where you at, Kenny? Where you at? You out there panhandling? You out there begging? You begging your family with some money? You out there begging? Huh? Are you out there begging, sir? Yeah, are you begging? <sighs> are you begging, Kenny? Because, see, we, we can zoom out like we're supposed to and have it the way it's supposed to be. <clears throat> what are you going to do, Kenny? Do a refresh. Is he live yet? He got the ball to come live? There's a piece of tape left from where the thing fell. See it right there. <laughs> Come on, Kenny. Look at the words. Look at the words here. Look at the words there. Look. The words are clearer here. Look how they look bunched up here. They look clear. Oh, what's the difference? Ten dollars, four hundred dollars. What's the difference? Save your money. You that desperate to have black, get you a white projection screen and get you a thin black fabric and put it over top of it. And there you go. There you go. You won't spend nothing. I'll give this man $400. They had to paint your screen and do all that shit. For what? For what? You're just wasting your money. Come on and come live, Kenny. You scared? Come on, Kenny. It's 11 o'clock. Where you at? Where you at, sir? You don't you, you come back with, with this crap? These USPS court boxes and shit? You come back with this? Huh? Huh? You broke bastard? You ain't got no money. This is supposed to be the best paint in the world. Look at this shit. Supposed to be the best paint in the world. Look at that whole shit. Oh, we the best paint in the world, huh? All right, y'all. Let me see if Crow or uh, Silent done any videos we can look at. 
And then I'm gonna get out of here. I I gotta get to work. I gotta put a uh, pro screen up. Let's take a look here. Hold on, anything new? Twelve days ago, got down, bro. Nope, ain't done nothing new. All right. See if sound done anything there. Live stream. Six days ago. Videos. One day ago. What are you talking about? Something that I really, really value for folks, especially folks that are just getting started. And Cinemax is a good representative of DIY that's available for a low cost, high performance solution. $60 for Cinemax for the quality that you're seeing right now with all the lights on in my space. I'm familiar with Cinemax, but it has been a little bit since I've seen it. It was actually one of the, I think it might have been Zoom in. the first screen paint that I purchased from Pro way back in the day on the old 100 inch screen. I don't see no difference. My, chain, my preferences and tastes have changed a little bit, but I feel like I'm looking at an old friend here. And again, I'm kind of jaw dropped in a way by what I'm seeing from such a simple, and I don't mean this in a bad way, but a simple yet effective solution. Can we zoom in some more? A low cost solution for people looking for a easy to do, no fuss, but no mess upgrade over a white screen, which is what Pro Screen Mixes. That mean you to get this, you gotta sit in front of the screen. Pro has taken his I've zoomed in, let's zoom out. Years of experience being a pressman, looking at colors, looking at the inks and the paints and stuff that they use to make Look at that, ladies and gentlemen. commercial and private use out in space in the world where he's from. All right, five minutes about dark. I'm out. Y'all have a good one. To find See you, everybody. We are. Of gray for screens. Thanks for watching. Do certain things based on your projector, your equipment, your environment. All right. And Cinemax is really a culmination 